You're watching the Weedy Mario 64. Wait, we only have 33 stars? I feel like it was like 15 minutes ago that I had 30. I feel like, okay, I feel like my progress is slowing up a little bit. Alright. Cuckoo Mountain. Alright, I was wondering where this was gonna be, because I feel like I was like, I feel like I haven't. I feel like I've gone in like almost every painting at this point. Like, obviously, there's still a few that I haven't gone in yet, but. I guess we just do. I guess we just do this level, or this mission real quick. The slip slide and away. So obviously it's it's programmed to spawn you at the top of the slide. It's like obviously if if you if it was randomized to the point where you could like spawn in at the bottom of the slide, that would be incredibly good RNG for speedrunners, but you're gonna spawn in at, at the top, no matter what. Which is not fun. Actually, is this that would be really good in RNG if this penguin was Oh, that is the right penguin. But it also spawned way up there. Alright, what star do I want to- what star do I want to get? I think I'll go ahead and get this one for the little penguin lost just because I don't know if- I don't know if the baby penguin can get re-randomized or not. So, if- if it can, then I'm just gonna go ahead and get that star just because it was pretty incredibly good RNG that the baby penguin was like literally right next to the, the mom penguin, so. And then I can go ahead and just get the uh, slide star again later. Alright, Big Boost Haunt. I wanted to come back here actually because Big Boost Haunt is actually pretty a pretty good stage for randomizer, so. Okay, look at me. Look at me! Look at me! <laughs> Ow. <laughs> it's kind of hard to tell where the eye is in relation to like it was kind of hard to tell where Mario was in like relation to the eye. I couldn't tell if I was like all the way behind him yet, so that's why I kept running into him. All right, 35 stars, not bad. All right, uh, so I'm pretty sure this, 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 this store is open now. Yes, okay. So because it is open and I'm just like right there, I'm gonna go ahead and go back to Koopa Mountain just because I can go ahead and get that star slide again. Slide star. <laughs> Let's see what this sign says. I haven't read a sign in a while. What? I don't know what that. I don't know what that dialogue box is. I don't even know what that means. Don't don't triple jump over the ice shoot. What? <laughs> I don't understand. I'm confused. All right, let's go ahead and go back on the slide. I'm at. I feel like in my brain, when I first said I can get go ahead and get the slide star real quick again, I, I'm pretty sure I said, go ahead and get the star slide again. I don't actually know if I actually said that or not, to be honest. I don't I don't know if I said it correctly the first time and it was just in my brain that I said it backwards. Or if I actually said it backwards. Can I sell me? <laughs> I was like pretty certain that he couldn't do that because he was so close to the edge. I wanted to watch it happen if it could happen. And I'm glad I watched because it can happen and it was the best thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Snowman suicide. <laughs> Greatest thing ever. Uh, but yeah, I feel like I feel like in my brain I said star slide, but I don't actually know if I actually said it. But if I did actually say it, then that could be bad because I feel like I've either already said a lot of things backwards and didn't realize it and just sound one stupid, or I could I don't I have yet to say things backwards and not realize it. But I'm glad I actually caught myself and realized that I said star slide. All right, let's go back and do more Big Boo's Haunt, just because Big Boo's Haunt is a fun time, dude. I guess that'd be in our best interest to go ahead and just like look around the mansion to see if we can find the stars that are just kind of loose and just chilling. First, before we actually go ahead and do the missions that require us to actually do something to make the star spawn. Uh, oh god, okay, apparently that was... I was gonna check the basement last, but apparently we're checking it now. It's not incredibly likely that there will be something in the basement, but uh, it is always not. It, 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 yeah. It's always possible that there will be something in the basement. Like the stars that are loose are more likely to spawn or be in like the upstairs area, 
but I have I have had seeds that uh, the loose stars in BBH will be in the basement. That's why that's why I was gonna check it last, but I fell. So yeah. And as my as to no surprise, there was nothing in the basement that I not that I could see of. If I was taking guess, then that means that all the other stars are in the mansion. That's a bax. That's a giant boo. Actually, there's not. Yeah, there's not any stars and boxes in Big Boo's haunt. Okay, well I well I guess since this guy is here, I guess we can go ahead and kill him then. Die! Thank you. Jeez. We're going all the way back outside. Well, I guess like <laughs> it, 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 it at least spawned in front of the mansion, so we don't have to go all the way back around the mansion. It did spawn like right here, didn't it? Uh, I'm confused. I'm pretty sure it spawned like right here in front of the house. This. Oh wait, is that? Yeah, that's it. I know that's. Well, I guess it is. Yeah. Okay. I was kind of. I was like, wait, that that's the, that's not it. But then also I was like, oh wait, I guess. Star Five is a mission where you have to kill a giant boo. Uh, I guess we can go back to CCM and do the big penguin race real quick. Oh, I could also go back to the THI and do uh, the Wiggler fight in the Koopa, the quick race. So we have a few missions lined up that we can do real quick. So that's good. And of course, it's spawned this down here to be a dickhead. Alright. Well, now that we're down here, let's just see if there's anything down here. I want that life. Never mind, the life wanted to die. And also I wanted to die, apparently, because I just... I, I chased it off of the ledge. Uh, I guess I can go back to... I'm just all over the place right now, because I don't even know where I'm going. I'm just dying and getting stars and places and all that nonsense. More stars and more places. I guess I can check the attic of the mansion real quick. Because I still haven't checked yet for stars. What's up, Mr. Scuttlebug? Ah! <laughs> that Scuttlebug defies gravity. He was like right on the platform that was pretty much sideways and, and he didn't go anywhere, so. Uh, okay, so far I'm not seeing anything up here. Uh, uh, I don't see anything that I need up here. Okay, uh, okay there's, there's just so many boos <laughs> in the front of the mansion that it's just like constantly making them laugh. Because they're consistent, like they're constantly just like spawning in and out. Uh, let me see if I can find the the booze real the the booze real quick. Actually, never mind. I don't want to do that right now. I don't feel like it. <laughs> uh, let me go back to Tiny Beach Island real quick and do the Wiggler fight. Well, I guess since we spawned right here, I can just jump up and do the Koopa the Quick race real quick. Now that I think about it. And then after this, we can go ahead and jump back into Rainbow Ride. We kept dying when I was trying to find a star in a box. Get out of my way, Goombas. Get out of my way! Okay, I've never died there before. That's why I have probably died there before. But for different reasons, obviously. I've never died there because Goombas were my way. Uh, okay. There is a Bax right here. Okay. There's only one star in a box in Rainbow Ride, I believe. So... But, let's jump back down without dying, please. That would be swell. Let's go ahead and see if that Bax down here is the star. Okay, let's not die trying to get this box this time. Okay, it was the star. <laughs> it's just last time I was trying to get it, I died. <laughs> okay, uh, what was in my board? Shifting Sandland. I don't want to do Shifting Sandland again. Actually, yeah, no, I don't want to Shifting Sandland. I want to go back to Hazemia's Cave to see what's in the metal cap, actually, but I, I don't remember where Hazemia's Cave is. Maybe, I think it was in the slide, maybe? 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 Nope. <laughs> I thought the mountain works too, I guess.
There's a star. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Except don't squeeze lemons because then you'll just be squirting lemon juice all over the place and that would be awkward. I don't know why that would be awkward, but... Right, do I have access to this room yet? I do. But for some reason Mario has to use star power to open it. Sometimes he does that and then sometimes he doesn't. It's really weird. Let's see if Mr. Bup is in here. I don't see a toad in here, so I'm not really sure where that second star that second toad star is. Which is unfortunate. But that is a-okay. Uh let's jump back into this level, because I don't remember what was in this level. I also don't remember what was in which our world, but I also that oh, was the cap. Okay. We don't need to do that. <laughs> uh what was in Lump's Fortress? A concussion. That was in, that was what was in more uh Wolf's Fortress. Alright, this was Darn Box. No, I don't know. I said Darn Box. Okay, I guess we can get the can the eel come into play star, I guess. What's up, Mr. Eel? And actually I guess I guess the star actually spawns in a random location because like even though the star is Oh god, okay, let me get out of here real quick. I'll <laughs> I'll come back for that star in a second. <laughs> I don't I don't have faith in myself that I can get the star off the, the eel's tail and then get it wherever it spawns to in however long that would have taken me to die. Which would have been a very short amount of time. Okay, I might be able to get the star still. Oh crap, I just ran right into this the tail. <laughs> I can still get it. I got it! <laughs> I don't think if the eel just like just flung its tail over, I don't think I would have got it. But but yeah, I guess even though the star is on the eel's tail, it still technically spawns in when you touch it. So because I, I I think I'm pretty sure I don't know how it actually works, but the the star that's on the eel's tail isn't like an actual star. It's just like a it's just an object, I guess. Or not like an object. It's just like it's connected to the eel until you touch it, and then like it tells the game to spawn in the star, where, where like the, in the coordinates that it's programmed to spawn in. But obviously, the coordinates for it to spawn in in this game are random for the randomizer. I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> I I never understood why there was just a box just sliding back on back and forth on the ship because like. Yeah, if it, if you get hit by it, it will damage. Like it'll damage you. Like you'll get hurt by it. But like, I feel like it's just easy to avoid. Like, obviously, the first time you play the game, you're gonna be like, "Oh, what's that?" and then try to like open it or something, and then just continuously get hurt by it. But then like after that, then it's just like you just avoid it. So there's like pretty much no reason for it. All right, we're at 40 stars. So that's actually pretty good. We're like almost there. We're almost we're almost to 70, which I didn't expect to get to. Like, I, like, I, I'm not saying that I didn't expect to complete the seed, but I'm just saying that, like, I'm still, this is still my, this is, this episode is still part of my first session, my first recording session, so, I wasn't expecting to get 40 stars in the first session. I have no, I have no idea how long I've been recording for, but, alright, uh, red coin, red coin, what you gonna do, what you gonna do when I, Come for you. Uh, sometimes I'll try to go for the because like I, I was saying this earlier, but I don't, I don't always go for stars like this that have red coins. But sometimes I will try to go for the the invisible cap red coins just because they're usually pretty easy to find. Just because they're normally like a lot of like a lot of the times they'll just they'll just be on the slide somewhere. Awesome. Bit of difficulty with this. Uh, I was trying to. I'm trying to get on the railing because there's a red coin there. But I'm struggling with that currently. Uh, a lot of the red coins on, in like a lot of the times the red coins for the invisible cap will be like on the slide somewhere, so they're pretty easy to find. But sometimes they're pretty hard to get to. Apparently, so I am on the struggle bus today. There we go. That's what I was trying to do for like the past 10 minutes. 
Now that I just said uh, the, that, that I was I was boarding the struggle bus, that actually made me think of something. Uh, I remember saying that. Uh, I don't remember when I said it, but it was like I was with Toby, and like he was like, "What the hell does that mean?" Like I, don't, I I'm pretty sure it wasn't on recording. I'm pretty sure it was just. Like, I want to say it was during our versus recording, but I'm pretty sure it wasn't. I'm pretty sure it was just at some random point when we were just hanging out. Like, he was like, that's not a saying. And I was like, I've definitely heard people say that before. But, and, that, and that begs the question, have you guys ever heard that phrase before? That you're on the struggle bus? Because I feel like I've definitely heard that people say that before. But according to Toby, it's not a saying. So. Need a, I feel the need to prove him wrong. Oh god, let's not die this far into the thing, please. Get that red coin. Thank you. Uh, I thought I saw another red coin, but I might be just losing my mind. <gasps> no, dude. Please go away. I don't see other, uh, yeah, on any other red coins up here. So... I'm gonna have seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, six. Okay, that means there's two left. So that means they have to be over here somewhere. Oh, there's one. Jesus. These fire chewers being randomized are the worst thing in the world. Uh, okay, am I not going to see up camp, please? I mean, I meant to do it, then I was like, well, actually, I'm right next to a fire spear, but let me. So let me not do that. Last time I was in here, I spawned in at the top here, but I don't remember seeing a red coin up here. So that's kind of why I'm like, I don't think there's any point to come up here. Yeah, I don't see. I don't see a red coin anywhere. Uh, I'm confused. Cannonball! How would I not die? I died. Fuck. I tried so hard, and then came so far, but in the end, it didn't matter at all. Because life sucks. <laughs> is, that, is that how the song goes? I'm pretty sure that's how it goes. Oh god. Uh, okay, I guess I can go for the igloo star. So I was going to do that before, and I don't remember what happened to that. <laughs> oh, I think I, I think I came into Stoneman's and I was like, I can get the igloo star, and then I ended up getting the chill boy star. <laughs> Oh, shut up. <laughs> Mario's, Mario's doing some dance moves on the egg wheeler. Alright, uh... Star. Star. This one up real quick. Not that I really need it. I have ten lives. What? Well, I had nine lives. Mario was a cat, briefly. There it is. Now I just need to figure out how to get it, because I can't tell where I am in the igloo, because it's just, it's, it's just confusing, just because, like, the camera isn't the best in here, and then it's like, you just don't know where you are. There we go. Like, the igloo star, the igloo star is kind of a gimme star, but, like, at the same time, it's not, because the, you have to work so hard to find it. I mean, you don't have to work that hard to find them, so. Uh, what do I want to do? Let's go back to whatever was in this level. Yes, yeah, so we That's actually a good idea because I kind of just like completely forgot about the stage. And I was like, oh yeah, I never actually did anything in it aside, aside from like one star. And I need more. Because that is the point of this game, if you weren't aware. In case you guys weren't aware what the, the goal of this game was. There you go. Oh my god. Big Blue's over there, so I guess I can go ahead and kill his little booty first. Oh my god, shut the fuck up. Like, I don't mind it when people text me, but like, I have this one friend that fi finds it necessary to, like, uh, for some reason, like, put, like, one sent- like, make one sentence into, like, 17 different messages for some reason. Like, if you want to tell me a story, just, like, tell it all in one paragraph, you don't have to send 17 different messages. <laughs> Like, it doesn't, like, it kind of annoys me, but then at the same time, it, like, I'm not gonna be like, shut the fuck up, please. Like, I don't wanna, I don't wanna, I don't, I don't wanna be a dick about it, but, like, it's not the most necessary thing in the world. 
There we go. Star collected. Alright, uh, I don't remember... Oh, the all of them was... Oh, there it is.